Hey, what's up, guys? Uh, Exotic Clan here, and uh, someone requested that I show them how I made my ping pong game. So let's get started. As you guys know, I got my new laptop. Yeah. Oh yeah. Windows 7 right now. Just finished installing all my shit. That's why I haven't made any videos. Um, okay, let's get started. Let's open Visual Basic. I don't have it right here. Fair. Dun, dun, dun. Okay, let's make a new project. Name it whatever you want. Make a tutorial. Okay, guys. Finish loading? Yeah, finish loading. Okay, I want to mark this size. 640 by... What did I play last time? Oh, 480. That's pretty big. I'm not really going to need no errors. I know I'm doing it right. Uh, let's see, let's see. What do we need? First off, we need a timer. I had a timer. I like naming all my stuff. I'm gonna name it a uh, game timer. What else do I need? Um, what the fuck is that? Just yeah, whatever. <laughs> Weird that shit just came up. Uh, oh, I'm gonna name the form. I don't like name it for more, I'll name it, uh, on name. What else? Oh, we need picture box. I'm not using labels this time. I'm using picture boxes. We need three of them one for the ball and two for the panels. Make sure you resize them. Mm, yeah, about that's pretty good. Leaving it 2020. 2020. That, that's that's pretty good for a ball. And I just gotta mess around with it, you know. It's smaller. Man, it's bothering me. Uh, okay, let's uh put this. Uh, put it. Uh, Back color, I'll put it up. Dark red. Just pick whatever you guys want, but just for now, put black or dark red. Uh, put the ball white. And I'll put this black. Now that looks nice. Okay. First things off, we're gonna name it. Yeah, we're, we're gonna be using this side like in my game. So, we gotta name this. So, we won't forget. Whatever, press something for mistake. important thing <laughs> we'll name it a uh, game ball something simple I won't forget oh snap I almost forgot we need two labels label one make a copy of it make it easier one and there's another label around here label two Rename them to uh, come score draw because that's what we're going to be using to draw the score. Just make sure you have to like zero. 
not label one. This core has changed the font, the color font. It's like whitish, so you could find it. <laughs> Any white color. Okay, there you have it. Let's make an eco. That's pretty good. Uh, what else? What else do we? we not, what else do we need? I labeled everything. Nope, I didn't label this. So, player was there. Okay, do we start coding now? Yes, we do. I'm gonna be explaining the code. I'm really gonna be typing right now because really, really long coding. But I, I made code so I could explain it. I guess. Uh, Let me open it. Wait, phone ringing. I'll answer it later. Set up. Here it is. I'll leave this in the description if you guys want. I'll leave the project. How about yeah? That's better. I'll leave the project. As you can see, whatever. This is just to uh, move the mouse. I use region. I like using region. Yeah, I'm just gonna let's see. Yeah, I, I put a com comments. See where the. It's just a moving mouse, basically. Really easy. What the fuck is this? <laughs> Windows matter now. Okay, this is for the timer. I labeled everything for you guys. That's gonna see, I guess. Remember, this will be in the description if you guys want it. Okay, I want to explain this to you guys. Uh, this is the ball speed, and then the maximum for here you could change it up. I like putting in nine. I think five is out way too slow, so I keep it in nine. That's just me. I don't know if you guys like it in five. I'm gonna change it right now. Um, I keep it on thirteen here and nine here. But also, um, I want to tell you guys, I don't know why you guys are using Visual Basic 2008. Dude, 2010 is free. Just like, go to Microsoft.com and download it. It's free. Um, we add this. Yeah, I put keys everywhere. I won't forget. We add this to the main timer. Yep, sorry about that. Yeah, we're, gonna, we're gonna be adding a lot of things in the main timer. So just get ready. Main timer is mostly the most important thing because that's what actually moves the ball and everything. Dude, like, seriously, shut up. This big ass code that I'm explaining a few. Just gonna add this all to the timer. Okay, let me see, let me explain. What this does is that when the ball hits the bottom wall, it's just gonna bounce. This that's all it's doing for all these. That's that's all all the code is doing. It's really simple to understand, but a lot of typing. Okay, let's go on. And I think we need one more thing, I think. Oh, two more. Just, uh, just to stable the game, set up the game. For the game, you know, I hate when the game freezes or lag too much. This is this is one of the codes that were not in my other one. This is going to be in the V2. 
you know, a multitasker, my V2, it's going to be in that one. It's more stable now. And this is just to end the game and press escape. Because, yeah, you don't want to lose. And, uh, this is just to resize it. Or it could be actually equal to everything. No cheaters, right? Okay, this, <laughs> I forgot to do something last time when I was making this. I, uh, <laughs> failed. I forgot to enable the, wait, let me move this. I forgot to enable the timer. So it's not doing anything. But just make sure you do that. Whoa, 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 we got some errors here. Let's see what we have here. Pong me. Yeah, but I actually have that. And I don't think I really need this. No, that's just garbage. Waste of my time. I have no clue why I got that error. Oh, there you go. <laughs> okay, so ping pong game. In part two, I'm going to teach you how to make a cover. Okay. Everything's working. Escape. Okay. Peace. Bitches.